fire was getting uh, out of hand. I mean, it was to the point where you, you could hardly breathe. The, the, the fire was that intense, the heat was that intense. There was a, a fire tornado that wrapped a piece of steel around a tree. And they said the winds had to have been over 200 miles an hour for that to happen. And I've never seen anything like that here. It's, it was very scary. This will be history. This is the worst fire I've ever seen here, ever. Uh, I don't know how I could get any worse than this. There's going to be a lot of people that, without money, it's going to cost a lot. I went to my mom's and they were all in a panic. And then the, by the next morning, it didn't seem like it was real yet. There was smoke, but that was it. And then I tried to get back home and it was, oh God, the second night about dark. It was like an inferno, we couldn't even get close. And my car burnt down. Um, it was at the deli and um, we couldn't get through. So my car is a total loss. I, I'm just getting through one day at a time, getting back and forth to work, um, wondering when I can get into my place, wondering when my mom's gonna be back home. It's been a nightmare. It seems like it's still kind of erratic in some ways, not as bad as the first days, but we're treating it like if it was the first day. Uh, we don't ever want to have our guard down. We, want, we don't ever want to be complacent. So they're treating it just like if it was day one, hopefully with Mother Nature behind our backs and giving us the, the weather that we need, we'll be able to hopefully uh, try to get this fire uh, um, under control, but we'll see, it just matters on uh, day by day. Everywhere around the state has just been getting hit a lot. And it's just a non-ending a non battle right now. With the amount of drought that we've had, not a lot of rain, um, that's really causing uh, some problems for us. And when you have drought and you have heat and no moisture, no nothing, we're gonna have a long fire season. We're at the end of July and we still got a long time to go. So it's, it's not over.